Are you ready? I feel like I'm about to go into surgery, Anne, but I am ready. Let's do this. Hi guys, welcome back to Momona's Mixed Plate. So this week, I'm going to be taking you through the entire process of getting my eyelash extensions done. So in Pakistan, it's a fairly new concept, like a lot of people haven't gotten them done yet, so I obviously had my reservations. But I actually met Anne Trin, who's actually married to our superstar Moeen Khan. So she's gotten her uh, training done from Singapore and until she hadn't moved to Pakistan, I was really against getting eyelash extensions done because I'd heard a lot of really weird things that were happening to people who were getting them done here, uh, whether they were getting eye infections or their eyelashes were falling off. So in any case, I have her in the studio with me today because I want to uh, bust all the myths that there are against uh, getting eyelash extensions done. So let's welcome Anne on uh, to MMP. Hi Anne. Hi Momona. How are you? Good, how are you? Good. So a few of the questions that I asked you, you were like that, you know, there's some of the biggest misconceptions about um, eyelash extensions or even eyelash an eyelash lift that people yeah. have in Pakistan. So when you moved here, what was the thing that you saw? Because there are a few people who are doing this. And what was, where did you feel the gap was? Um, the gap was uh, precision, I think, um, and styling and just education education for the clients. Um, a lot of the clients that kept, came to me have eyelashes falling off. Uh, is it going to harm their natural lashes? How are they going to take care of it? Some people think they last forever. Some people think they last a couple of days. Uh, so a lot of myths uh, surrounding it and yeah. just, uh, I don't know, it's well, pretty new here. It's been in the States for about 10 years or so. Yeah. More more than 10 years, but approximately two or three years here. My biggest thing was because I had heard about that my own eye, like your own eyelashes fall off with it. Uh, and you're, you're saying that's not the case at all? It's not the case. Your natural lashes do go through a growth uh, cycle. Um, about three to five fall off daily. Uh, so it just refreshes every time. So just you know your lash extensions are semi-permanent they're not permanent they'll last probably three weeks until about half of them have fallen off and you need a refill um, if they're attached wrong and uh, onto multiple lashes instead of just on one single natural lashes then yes your lashes will fall off prematurely so of course it is uh, completely up to the artist to make sure that their clients natural lashes are completely preserved so the very most important thing is uh, the prep before the lash extensions. Uh, you would want to wash the lashes uh, completely clean, make sure all makeup and debris and dirt and oil is off of it. Uh, then I usually prime the lashes and strip off any last bits of oils and give, uh, give me a complete blank and clean template to work with. The main thing that I really want to stress is having proper isolation. You can see me uh, using one tweezer in my right hand, just kind of propping all the other lashes apart, giving me one lash to work with, and the other tweezer just picking up and dipping in the glue. You should not be seeing any glue um, on her natural lashes or on extensions. It's so minute the amount that I'm using that it should just be one clean look. Um, I like using a hydrogel pad to, uh, to keep her bottom lashes um, separate from her upper lashes um, and it's also soothing for the client when they're closing their eyes. I use tape to kind of move her eyelids around and just kind of prop my uh, canvas <laughs> in a way where her lashes are showing and stretching out and um, giving me a clear space. So after we're done, we just kind of brush it out, buff them out and remove the gel pads, the tape carefully. So the procedure took about three hours. 
an hour and a half on each eye, right? If you have any questions, please uh, just type them out in the comment section of this video and I will get Anne to answer all of them for you. Like if you have any myth, she's based in Lahore and thank you so much for coming in and you know, busting all these myths that people have had. And guys, don't forget to subscribe, share and comment and all your comments below will be answered. I hope you enjoyed the video and I'll see you next time. Take care. Oh,